health care providers in Kentucky are beginning to get some much-needed good news as coronavirus cases continue to fall. In his Team Kentucky update Thursday afternoon, Governor Andy Bashir noted that hospitalizations for COVID-19 have fallen 17 percent over the past week. That is beginning to provide some relief to overwhelmed hospitals as the trend continues. We were a little bit worried that we might see a leveling out, but every day it seems we see a decrease and there is certainly now a trend in hospitalizations. We're seeing this across the United States. It is incredibly good news. It is easing some of the pressure on our hospital systems with now just 58 of 96 hospitals reporting critical staffing shortages. The governor also took time to point out the most dramatic effects of vaccination by comparing the number of COVID-related deaths between vaccinated and unvaccinated Kentuckians. Since July, among all patients under the age of 60, those who have not been vaccinated have been dying at a rate 20 times higher than those who have. That translates to 21 vaccinated deaths compared to 422 unvaccinated deaths. What this ought to show is even if you think you're young enough to battle this thing off, if you are unvaccinated, you you are in trouble. This thing is that deadly. It's looking to spread, especially from unvaccinated to unvaccinated. Please go out and get that shot. A lot of protection if you are vaccinated. To celebrate the positive trend in the pandemic, as well as the state's recent good economic news, such as Ford Motor Company announcing it will invest $5.8 billion and create 5,000 jobs in Kentucky, Bashir called on Kentuckians to brag a little bit. The governor is asking Kentuckians to post why they are proud to be from Kentucky using the hashtag Team Kentucky.